Hey third grade, this week for pattern we are going to be creating a Jim Dine inspired heart picture. So you'll need your pencil, sharpie, eraser, and crayons for this. We're not going to be coloring it today, but you're still going to need your crayons just to make your patterns. So I want you to draw with me for the first part. You're going to need your pencil and on your paper with your protective paper underneath, you are going to draw the biggest heart that you can on your page. Fill it up. So take your time, draw a nice heart. If you need to pause it to draw your heart, you can. My heart's not perfect, it doesn't have to be. Then I'm going to take and go right down the middle of my paper, make a line, and I'm going to go across the center of my paper with another line. Okay. Once you're done with that part, you are going to trace all this with your Sharpie. And if you need to erase any peaking pencil, go ahead and do that. So I'm going to just trace mine quick so you can see. You can pause it and trace yours as well. After you're done, give it a little scrub with your eraser to clean it up. going to be picking out different colors for each section. You're going to use two colors. So in this first section of my heart right here, I'm going to pick out two colors and I'm going to make a pattern in there repeating. So it could be a line. So maybe I do straight lines with my pink. And then I could repeat something else in between them, okay? And I'm pushing really hard with my crayon because I want those colors to be really, really dark and bold. All right, so I've made my first design. Then I'm going to pick out two different colors. And I'm going to do something different here in this next one. Maybe some circles. Now you don't have to do the same thing as me. I want you to come up with your own and your own colors. So you can just watch for this part. Whoops. <laughs> watch for this part. That's what happens sometimes when you're pushing hard. Just to see. Notice how I'm not coloring in anything. I'm just basically making lines, right? Then I'm going to pick out two different colors. Do something different here. Again, it can be big lines, little lines. Do some spirals. Okay, last one, two colors. Most important thing is that you're pushing hard with them. I dropped my other color here. And just repeating your designs. When you're done filling each section differently with patterns, you're going to post a picture and keep this for next week when we finish it up then. Hope you guys have fun starting your Jim Dine Hearts.